So this week in cancellation, people are canceling Pepe Le Pew. Now I'm not a big fan of cancel culture, but I why hasn't this happened years ago? Like, like this. He's a cartoon character. He's a cartoon character. I get it. You know, he's not real. Uh, but if there was a list of worst comic, or if there's a list of worst cartoon characters ever, <laughs> Pepe Le Pew would definitely be, be top five. Like, this is the the most like blatant rapist. I've ever seen on a small screen. Um, so yeah. apparently they cut Pepe Le Pew from Space Jam 2. There was a scene where there was a, I think a girl was, um, had a scene with Pepe. Pepe was being extremely Johnny Bravo-ish rapey, like, hey, come here, baby. Hell, I love you. And I guess the girl swiped Pepe and got a restraining order. So that was in the first draft from what I read. Um, but the new director, I guess they got a new director later. The new director said, hey, we're just gonna take this scene out, and we don't need Pepe Le Pew. Um, there's a lot of people outraged, like, "Oh no, they're canceling Pepe Le Pew! This is crazy." Okay, first of all, let's get real. How many of you, as kids, lo- hey, I want the Pepe Le Pew backpack? Never happened. It didn't even exist. Did it? Didn't even exist. Can I have the Pepe Le Pew toy? You know damn well you wasn't asking for it. Hey, I, that's my favorite cartoon, Pepe Le Pew. No, I think even as kids, we we're like, "Yo, who wants a skunk?" Who wants a skunk? First of all, and first, I think, <laughs> I think even as kids, we didn't even understand like you know uh, sexual assault and all this stuff. But even as kids, you're like, what is this guy's deal? Like the cat's just trying to exist, and he's just like, I'm gonna, you know, <laughs> I'm gonna put my paws on you. <laughs> it was, it was just the weirdest <laughs> choice of an animated cartoon. I mm-hmm. understand it was a different time, but I even think at that time people were like, what the hell is this? Why, why is this a thing? Have you ever watched Pepe Le Pew? Enough to know who he is, but I don't really have any recollection. So the whole much. the whole story, because we, we know all the other stories, like uh, Sylvester and Tweety, like Sylvester always trying to kill Tweety and eat him. Surprisingly, that's not as bad as Pepe Le Pew. Um, Elmer Fudd was trying to catch uh, Bugs Money. Uh, Bugs and Daffy always had like a, a back and forth. Uh, even with Rio, Stephanie, Sam. But the, the story of Pepe Le Pew and, and the Pussycat was the cat accidentally got paint on its back. And... Pepe thought it was another skunk, and he's like, yo, <laughs> I want to tap that ass. <laughs> so this cat would just be walking, like, hey, baby, I love you. Come here, baby, and just fill up on the cat. The cat was like, get off me. What's wrong with you? <laughs> the whole time. That's funny. So there's a, there's a problem with cancel culture. I'll give it that. Like, people are looking every day to cancel something. They it's are. getting annoying. Please, people enough People just ain't got it. nothing to do. But I will say this. This is might be as equally bad fake outrage uh, culture. Somebody like Pepe Le Pew that nobody, if they didn't announce that Pepe Le Pew wasn't in Space Jam 2, I don't think anybody would have batted an eye. Just like with the Dr. Seuss books. Just like with the Dr. Seuss. No one would have noticed because no one read those books anyway. (laughs) So this is, that's what I'm saying, like fake outrage culture is just as bad as cancel culture. Like this is a non-story. Pepe Le Pew is a rapist skunk. Are we really going to shed a tear that he's not going to be in Space Jam 2? (laughs) <laughs> now, if it was Bugs Bunny, Daffy, Taz, people that kids loved. Probably as... would have never even noticed. Yeah. Honestly. You would never notice if Bugs Bunny wasn't in, or are you saying Pepe Le Pew? No, Pepe Le Pew. Pepe Le Pew, yeah, that's what I yeah. thought. Yeah, yeah. Well, obviously, you would know if Bugs Bunny wasn't in. Obviously. No, I probably wouldn't have noticed it. In Space Jam 1, I think he was in this movie one time. Uh, Michael Jordan picked him up and used him as a weapon because of... Uh, you know, he wasn't raping in that movie for some reason. <laughs> but... <laughs> But no, his whole character just went out the window. He was just okay. there for skunk purposes. So I, I gotta say, like cancel culture, yes, it's going amok. But some characters deserve to just like, okay, we gotta move on. We, and I think it's time to move on with Pepe Le Pew. Pepe Le Pew never had his own solo movie. Never had his own cartoon series. It was just clips of a of a skunk raping a cat. And I think I and think I, our kids are better off without it. Yeah, I don't Let understand why everyone's like upset. Like, <laughs> you want characters that are portraying rape in well, your just, movies? People are just like outraged of like their 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 childhood just being erased. But okay, uh, my argument still stands. You're a grown up now. <laughs> There's that, and <laughs> you want a character that's raping that, that rapes other rape characters. This is what you want. This is what you're fighting for. Maybe. I would, I would be, I feel like it would be more worth the outrage, even though it would still be fake, but more worth the outrage if they said, nah, we're going to keep him in and we're going to put in a rape scene. 
Like, people should be like, fuck no. <laughs> My kids are going to watch this. They I don't should know why. watch I just, that. I just picture, like, there's a scene where LeBron is just teaching them how to play basketball. All right, we're going to run, we're going to run our, our, our stuff. Peppy, what are you doing? I'm raping this cat, baby. High five. No, Peppy, not cool. <laughs> You're off the team. What? Oh God! Oh, let he doesn't us... get any time. He just gets kicked off the team. Just gets kicked way off to, the team. Way to keep up with the culture. Yeah, I guess Rock Turner Turner was a Pepe Le Pew fan. Yeah. All right. Let us know in the comments it's where it all started. Yeah. It's all it's all Pepe Le Pew's fault. Pepe Le Pew, Johnny Bravo. <laughs> we're better off without cartoons like this. Seriously, you know. I, let us know in the comments. Are you upset? That Pepe Le Pew is not going to be a Space Jam 2? Was that your favorite Looney Tune? Let me know why he wasn't. Because obviously he wasn't. I'm just going to, I'm going to speak for you. I don't like to speak for other people, but he wasn't. Come on. All right. Let us know in the comments. All right. That's going to be a good one. All right. Insert rape scene. <laughs> that was going to be demonetized. That was not going to get paid. <laughs> I'm not going to get paid off of none of that. <laughs> Insert right scene here. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> Peppy, Peppy Le Pew. Who the fuck wrote that shit? That's funny. Some old white man. Some old white man. You know what would be really funny? If a skunk raped the cat. <laughs> We're gonna kill him with that. Yeah, go on. Cancel culture. God, I will not lose sleep over that one. Help keep brother out the street. Subscribe to my dad's YouTube channel. Love, peace, and chicken.